Mama dropped a dime on me? <laughs> she wanted to be sure I knew the real reason you did it. To get her a Christmas present. You mean to tell me I've been worrying about this all this time when I could have been worrying about something else? <laughs> That's right. Hey, wait, Pop, has all of this got something to do with your friend in there? Yeah. I want you two to hang here for a while. I got some business to discuss. Oh, no, let me get in, Pop. No. <laughs> Thanks, son, but taking out the trash is my job. <laughs> now, Monk, you came over here to discuss something of great importance to both of us, didn't you? Hey, hey, baby, hold it down. They hear you. Say what? Oh, yeah. Now, <laughs> about this proposition, I just reached my decision. You got me cornered. So obviously, you win. <laughs> now we're getting somewhere. Where did I get my thousand? Well, look, I'm a little low on cash right now. But there is something in this room more valuable to you than that. The TV stereo combination? Nope. The dining room set? More personal than that. Hey, wait a minute. I don't see nothing around here looks that valuable. That's because you're sitting on it. Where? Damn. What's the matter with you, nigga? You flipped. I'm giving you a chance to save your butt. Now get out. I ain't leaving here empty-handed. That's right. For three. Too late, sucker. I already told you. <laughs> Why'd you go and do a dumb thing like that? <laughs> Look, Chuck, get out of here. There's people like you, blabbermouths, <laughs> that ruined the blackmail business. <laughs> 